is. So me and Dana are going to this party this evening. I was just wondering if you want to tag along. Tag along? That's what I mean. You know, just come on, man. You've been working so hard for your job lately. It's rough, but really? I don't need pity. Come on, it'll be fun. You need to loosen up a bit. Fine, I'll go over. Do you need to bring a date or anything? Like, I've never been to a formal party before. No worries. I'll just make sure you come home with a date this time. All right, let's get a move on. Dana's supposed to meet me at the party. Can you drop me off first? I gotta get changed and we can take it from there. Wouldn't it make sense to go to your house first, then mine? I mean, the party is close to your house, isn't it? Just drop me off first. I gotta get something. You better not be doing what I think you're doing. Come on, it's just this once. We're going to a party. I can't say something like this, sir. Eh? Well, it's not that easy to quit. You wouldn't have the slightest clue. You mean to get some help? Promise me you won't tell her. You know what? I won't tell her if this, if this is the last time, okay? This is the last time. You promise? I promise. No, that's fun. Remember what it says? Yeah, yeah. Hey man, it's Derek. Where have you been? I haven't heard from you all week. Hope you're coming out tonight this time. Well, give me a shout. We're all getting kind of worried. Hey man, are you ready? Yeah, I'm not. Uh, not too sure about that. What's the matter this time? I've been working all day, man. Too tired, okay? It would be nice if you could actually make it out this time. Fine, fine. Might as well come along. That's the spirit. Pick me up soon. Yeah, see me soon. I'll get ready. Hey man, what took you so long? Nothing, it's getting ready. Well hurry up man, Dana's waiting for me. Oh, and you care because? Just, just drive man, just drive. I think Dana has to know about this, okay? Come on, she doesn't have to know. It's none of your business, it's none of her business, it's my business, she doesn't have to know. You know what is my business? You're my, you're my best friend, you're about to get married. I think she has to know. No she doesn't, what's your problem? My problem is that it's still acting mature, it's still acting like a little kid. You should be growing up by now. Stop doing this drugs. Okay, okay. You know what? This is the last time. But you better not send me to some stupid rehab clinic. You know, that's actually a pretty good idea. I think you need to go. I think you need some help. I think that Dana needs... <laughs> Don't you say anything to Dana. It's been a while since you've been here, hasn't it? Try to avoid it. It's okay. I think we all try to avoid it. It's just finally nice seeing you here. It's just hard to get over it. You know that last time I was with him, we were fighting. I'm sure he would have forgiven you. It's not like you didn't try to stop him. I could have stopped him. I was the one who drove him home. He's too scared to tell his fiance that. It's not your fault. Everything happens for a reason. It was just unfortunate that it happened to him. Hey, right, Roger. I want you to be my best man at my wedding. Watch out! Rest in peace, Steven. <laughs>